Heliolisk! Hi, my name is Professor Silver, and in today's class, we'll be breaking down the complete history of Clement's Heliolisk, detailing all its battles, storylines, and character development. Heliolisk is Clement's main Pokémon in both the manga and core series, but received minimal focus in the anime as Clement left it at the Lumios Gym while traveling with Ash. Unlike Chespin, Bunnelby, and Luxray, Heliolisk never received an origin story or any major character development. All we know about Heliolisk's past is that Clement evolved it from a Helioptile with the Sunstone. Prior to Heliolisk's debut in Clement's Got a Secret, it defended the Lumios Gym from challengers and contributed towards Clement's goal of becoming a master Electric-type trainer. At the start of Pokémon XY, Clement wanted to focus Focus more time on inventing, so he built a robotic stand-in named Clembot, programmed the robot to replace him as gym leader, and lent it Heliolisk, Magnemite, and Magneton. Soon after Clembot's creation, it malfunctioned, kicked Clement out of the gym, and started terrorizing all the gym's challengers. Even though Heliolisk was kind and good-hearted, it went along with Clembot's directives, as Clement had ordered it to follow all the robot's orders. Clement wanted to end Clembot's tyranny, so he battled Heliolisk with Bunnelby. Bunnelby seized an early lead by blocking Thunderbolt, overpowering Dragontail, and setting up Dig. Proving itself Clement's original ace, Heliolisk brought Bunnelby to the surface with Bulldoze, slammed it downwards with Dragontail, and overcame Double Team with Parabolic Charge. Despite Heliolisk's higher level, Bunnelby won out thanks to Clement's superior skill as a battler. Bunnelby dug underground, activated Double Team, struck with Dig, and triumphed with Mudshot. It pained Clement to hurt Heliolisk, but Heliolisk quickly forgave him. While Clement traveled through Kalos with Ash, Heliolisk stayed with Clembot and fought many trainers like Tierno and Alvin. It wasn't until Clement returned to the gym and began training for his Lumios gym challenge with Ash that Heliolisk finally made a major return to the series. Heliolisk readied itself for Ash in confronting the darkness by fighting Belmondo's Magneton. At the battle's start, Heliolisk jumped away from Thundershock and batted away Electro Ball. Magneton absorbed the blast and tackled Heliolisk into the ground, but Heliolisk refused to give up, dodged Flash Cannon, let loose Parabolic Charge, withstood Tackle, and recovered its energy. It's likely Heliolisk would have won the battle, but Team Rocket disrupted the match before it concluded. During the gym battle itself in Moment of Lumio's Truth, Heliolisk dominated Ash's Gudra. It ran around Dragon Pulse, blinded Gudro with Flash, did super effective injury with Dragon Tail, avoided another Dragon Pulse, and paralyzed Gudro with Thunder Wave. Since Heliolisk's speed overwhelmed Gudra, Ash swapped the dragon for his quick footed Halucha. Heliolisk preempted Thunder Wave with Karate Chop, but Heliolisk fired back with Parabolic Charge and healed itself by absorbing the attack's remnants. Rather than let Halucha land Flying Press, Heliolisk produced a blinding flash, unleashed another Parabolic Charge, and overwhelmed its Luchador opponent with its incredible speed. Unfortunately for Clement, Ash realized Heliolisk flared its frills before attacking, waited until Heliolisk readied its next attack, and commanded Halucha to take it out with High Jump Kick. Luxray avenged Heliolisk, but Ash ultimately won the battle thanks to Gudra. Following Ash's victory, Clement returned Heliolisk to Clembot and resumed his travels. Heliolisk didn't appear until Saga's end when Clembot rushed to Clement's aid against Team Flare in Coming Apart at the Dreams. Finally appearing alongside Clement's other Pokémon, Heliolisk saved Clement, blinded Aelianus Dredigan, sent Bryony's Lipard flying, and bought Clement the time he needed to retake the Lumios Gym. Because Clembot sacrificed his memory banks to free Z2 from Team Flare, Clement and Heliolisk spent much of battling with a clean slate, helping Clembot reacclimate to life as a gym leader. During a rematch with Alvin, Heliolisk served as Clembot's last hope against Cubo. Heliolisk dodged Brick Break, fired off Dragon Tail, and stopped Cubone in its tracks with Focus Blast, but ultimately lost the battle after Cubone toppled a second Focus Blast and fired off Bone Marine. Though Heliolisk lost the battle, its valiant effort helped Clembot regain its glory as a gym leader. Since Clement stayed in Kalos when Ash returned home, it's likely that Heliolisk has rejoined his team and is busy making up for all the time they spent separated. And now for the battle record. Heliolisk didn't win a single battle on screen, but we can assume it collected many victories at the Lumios Gym. On screen, it lost to Clement's Bunnelby, Tierno's Squirtle, Ash's Halucha, and Alvin's Cubone. Over the course of the series, Heliolisk used Thunderbolt, Dragon Tail, Bulldoze, Parabolic Charge, Flash, Thunder Wave, and Focus Blast. There's no denying Luxray stole Heliolisk's thunder and usurped its position as Clement's ace. Due to a lack of exposure, Heliolisk never lived up to its full potential. It's a major shame as Heliolisk had an insanely diverse moveset, a wildly energetic personality, an incredibly unique fighting style, and an exceptional design. Despite my dissatisfaction with how the writers treated Heliolisk, I thought it served as a fitting bridge to Clement's passes 
as a gym leader. Whenever Clement returns to the series, I hope the writers rectify their mistake and give Heliolus the respect it's due by giving it at least one victory. Until then, class is adjourned. Make sure to subscribe and hit the bell so you're never late, and for extra credit, like this video and let me know your thoughts on Clement's Heliolisk. Until next time, catch you later.